Nicole Larry Parker and you're watching the ATL Profile. And welcome everybody to the ATL Profile. It's your host Christopher Martin and I like it, dare I say love it, when the ATL Profile comes to the Hyde Museum of Art. It is the first solo exhibition of a living African American artist and he goes by the name of Ratcliffe Bailey. The exhibit is Memory as Medicine and without any further ado, you know what we do with the ATL Profile where you are always in style. For me, it's a very historic evening, uh, you know, honoring Ratcliffe and his contributions to the world. But more than that, to have uh, this exhibit here at the Woodruff Art Center, where I was artistic director for like 11, 12 years here. But to see this day when uh, a, a, a black man uh, has his stuff where it belongs. You know, there's so many stereotypical images in the media uh, that we're sort of combating on a daily basis, and this is one of those uh, situations where it's important to, to, to sort of get behind somebody like Ratcliffe. Describe it. Describe his talent. Describe it in the best adjective that you can, Amanda. It's art that speaks to you. Uh, you can spend time with it and look and get different things from it depending on what type of medium you're looking at because he does work in so many. And um, it takes you back. It, it brings history to present day and you can relate to it. So on my father's side, um, they're descendants of African Americans that were part of the Underground Railroad. And so I'm kind of dealing with that history. Now you guys know because you watch this show all the time that Christopher Martin likes to go out with a bang. But I'm going to keep it calm as we close this edition of the ATL Profile, the Hyde Museum. Radcliffe Bailey, African American artist on his special night. Always, folks, get to www.atlprofile to see everything that we are involved in.